It's going to be a long run for everybody involved. Who's going to get it? Tony Kemp. Hang on, Tony. Not a bit. Pops right back up. Heck of a play. Navigating through the bullpen mound. Never easy. And Cedric Mullins toward the middle. Kike Hernandez spikes it into the ground. No chance to get Cedric, who's got a leadoff base hit. In fact, he may have gotten a second base umpire. Gonzalez. Yeah, I'm kind of wondering. I mean, the ball didn't go anywhere. Oh, he nailed him. Start break. Up the middle. Look at that play by the pitcher. Nobody. What is this? Oh, he never went to the bag. He never threw it to Soderstrom. And I tell you, Eric Young Jr. is screaming. Runner goes. Throw to second base. It is in time. Kemp lost the glove. And the glove's sitting right behind second base. So he's told huh? Kemp. And the glove came right off. Close to second one. Turn to first in time. Bell was just running as fast as his big body could. Whoa, throw it and duck. That's what he did. I think he saw flashing before your eyes was his life. Ooh, ooh he took his cap off. Cap off. Wow. I've never actually seen that. I would agree with you, and I'm, I'm glad he doesn't have my haircut. On the ground to third base. Machado will go to second for one. They get one. That's it. This could have been gnarly right here. Very awkward Bogarts from the shortstop position. Go first is in time, and oh. Schwarber trips over the bag and goes head first down into the dirt. He hops up quickly. Hopefully, he's all right. In the shallow center field. Might be trouble, and Wade juggles. Can't make the play. Falls in for a base hit. By the way, trying to make the over the shoulder catch. That just knocks the breath out of you a little bit. He is there, shovels it off to nobody, and headed for third is Bryson Stott. Altuve thought the Pena was going to first, or thought Altuve was going to second. Altuve. Oh, oh my! That got a piece of Zach. He's a tough guy. I don't know if that got him or, or the glove or his back. Oh, I mean, that got to him in a hurry. In a long way to go for Escobar. It's just too far. And please, somebody lock the gate for crying out loud. That's not supposed to happen. One, two from Senga. And the bat goes flying. Guriel strikes out, and Senga has a strikeout for his first out. It was the ghost, Keith. The ghost that made Guriel's bat disappear. This inning, runner still at first, two out, and a 2-2 pitch from Valdez. Garcia takes ball three. Whoa, we look at him with a cartwheel. We're choosing a lot of good hits here. Yep, got the front foot. Oh. Threw it out off of Tani's bat. McGuire goes to throw this ball back to Crawford, and when he does, right off of his bat, luckily it just drops right backwards. It could have gone anywhere. Well, Tani shouldn't. He can't see. He doesn't have no idea where it is. Here comes Stani, kicked it into foul territory. Wow. An amazing turn of events here. This is a ball that go up in the twilight. Tries to make a diving stop and then naturally. Well, you want to see like a Pete Rose dive just way up in the air. And it's fair and it's a hit and Adele goes head over tail. You can't throw it from, the, from in the stands though. And the Dodgers are going to get a double out of it. A chop out to second. Backhand pick. Hey, everybody's going to be safe. Torres with the backhand pick decided to try to get the out at second and had no chance. So stumbles over the first base bag. You hope he's okay. I don't think I've ever seen that. Look at this. Ward down second and he slips and falls. It probably saved the Angels an out because I think if Ward didn't fall down, he's thrown out at third base. Davis fell as he left the batter's box. Got him by a step and a half. Or no, he only ran a step and a half. Little dribbler, third base side, tough play. Oh, 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 no. That can't be how it ends. Wow. That is just so unfortunate. Oh, this, is, this is just gross. This is a perfect game on this. Burdick charging in, sunglasses. I can't find it. The sun and the wind. Helping out the Cubs, and two are in scoring position. They slipped around first, they tag him out. Half rounded the bag and then slipped trying to get back. He was tagged out. Grief. This was before the inning, and Bobichette all of a sudden, something bit him. Might have gotten a bee sting or something just before this half inning began. Still kind of looking down at it between pitches every now and again. 
three and two. That one now it gets the first base umpire. And uh, Eric Hosmer doesn't seem to like anybody down that line. Yeah, they hit some nasty glares. <laughs> like, man, you gotta have quicker feet. Up, up room for Hayes Newman. Oh no! And it drops fair. Throw to first. No, box. Not only is it not caught, but it drops in. Herrera is taken for third. They're gonna wave him. Ball got away from Thomas, who falls down on the warning track. You know this is gonna happen in the rain. Guys can't run into the corner. They're scared to slip. They do slip. Martinez sends a drive out the other way. Ren Hefo back at the wall. Oh man, it's over him. I don't know if Louis lost that in the sun. Yeah, I think he lost it at the last. Two he's thrown, folks. Swings at the first pitch on the ground and it's kicked by Espinal, who has not played in a game in about two and a half weeks off the injured list for this series. And the first he has, he's a very good defensive player. He doesn't handle it. On the ground to first and it gets by Guriel. Booted by Guriel. It goes down the line. Couldn't come up with it. Looked like it hit off the heel. <laughs> in fact, that is now confirmed. The research confirms loft in lights. I'll tell you what though, that big smile looked like the lights. It did. Soto's back on it. He lost it in the sun. Feeling to second with a sun aided double. As Soto couldn't find it in this sunny solo with the mask off. Who's going to make the play? It's Machado. And sure enough, they get the out. Nolan Machado with a little bit of a collision there. They dropped the ball as Judge came in front of him. Vasquez got off the bag. And he has to scamper to first. And this will be an error in and out of the glove. You have to think. With that big body playable, Noda and Perez, and they dropped it. They both had a chance to catch it, and they bumped into each other, and that hurts. There goes the bat, a swing and miss. Well, the bat headed toward the hole between short and third, and he missed the pitch. Cued up the line. That's going to work its way fair. Hit the base, bobbled by Solano, feeds over the head, but he's safe. Some strange spin on that baseball up the first base lot. Keller can't make the play. Everybody's going to be safe. Look like it had some fun coming off the bat. And that's the kind of play you hope doesn't turn into a big inning. Pete Rose dive. <laughs> How about that? Look at wow. that. Big time. He just loves playing baseball. And Every this is dropped at first base. And the question is, did he have it to finish the deal? And the answer is no. It was in his glove for a half second. And then throws a breaker that's rolled the first and Vlad Guerrero Jr. whose throw is high. He knows right away. Jump, get up. <laughs> and he's going to test the arm of his buddy Adolis and the throw. Safe, it's a double. <laughs> and Randy points out to his good buddy. Adolis had said don't even have. Jose Siri is having trouble giving away a baseball, so he just threw it into the fountains. Twice he tried to give it away to a fan, and twice it came back on the field. So finally he just <laughs> heaved it. Julio racing over, slowing down. Oh, and he lost it in the sun. He lost it in the sun, could not see it. It's a tough spot right right where you really never quit running at all. <laughs> he just took a circle, right? <laughs> Not in time. Throw the second. Goes into center field. McNeil the third. He's going to come around and score. And the Mets take the lead. Wow. A two-run single by McNeil. He scores on the off. Backhand lost by Skinner. De La Cruz got it. Fire. Got him. That's teamwork. Well recovered. <laughs> Put out right here. Yeah, nice job of not giving up on it. Casey throwing to third when there was nobody covering. Cortez trying to go to third and gets thrown out easily. The Marlins get, the Mets get it out. I don't know what Joey's thinking. He's right there with Mauricio. Pops this one in the infield. It's going to be Schmidt from third. Sidewall in his Wrigley Field career. Calm down, Riz. <laughs> <laughs> Take it easy, man. Pilar will need a new pair of slacks. Good hitting, but bad sliding. <laughs>
<laughs> he barely made it to second base. That's going to hit him. He got drilled by that pitch, assuming he felt it. You know, for a lot of these players, they aren't that far removed from their Little League days. And for a guy like Brandon Marsh, <laughs> who's, by the way, one of the most... Means, please. Yes, I it believe. does. Thank yes. you so much. Marlon's <laughs> ball boy. Yeah. You know, the, this is a very underrated aspect. Highlights. We have some great plays by the ball boys and ball girls dudes and ball whatevers. Great play here. Shoestring catch. You save a lot of lives down that line. Heads up! Heads up! Jacob Stallings trying to go, woo! But the good news is Joey didn't have really that low because he starts off kind of low, you know, oh. so he's got yeah. quick things. Oh, that's, that's, that's baloney. You know I'm just uh -oh. coming in and yeah. Zim! Come on, Zimmy! Oh. One to Oh, communication! A Rosarina. And Wander, see? This is what. But you know what, Wander? He's the priority. 